boy. It is finally here, guys. What I promised a year ago, the playthrough is finally here. Yep. This is it. What is up, guys? It's I, Jane Poop here, with a brand new playthrough. <clears throat> and this time we're going to do... One of the better Resident Evil games, uh, Resident Evil 5, uh, uh, this came out on Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, PC, and then remastered for PS4 and Xbox One, which is why I'm playing this on, I'm playing this on Xbox One X, I'll play more of that in a moment, and, um, and later in 2019 it got ported to the Switch. So, yes, off we go with... Yep, here we go, and I've got two profiles because obviously we got, uh, there's something we got to do, which is a glitch, uh, which I'll do later on. But but as you can see, um, this is all HD, so I'm on the remastered version of the game, obviously. So uh, you got smoother frame rate and um, and all that. So I'm gonna quickly go into options. Controller settings. For some reason, on Xbox, the default is Type D, but I prefer Type A. So, basic control type based on Resident Evil 4. Uh, so, I prefer those controls, um, which makes the controls exactly the same as Resident Evil 4. On, um, I, don't know, I don't know why it's customized. I don't know what the difference is. I don't know what it was in the original 360 one and PS3 one, but audio, that's pretty much fine. Screen settings, that's fine as well. That's just the brightness. I used to have it up high, but I'm, I'm just going to have the normal setting. And, yeah. Uh, nothing else, really. So let's just go on ahead. And we have uh, a couple of options. We've got new game. We've got chapter select. So, yeah, you can pick previous chapters. Uh Because there's only one save file. It's not like multiple saves. So not like Resi 4. Uh, item management, which I can't do yet. We've got bonus features as well, so we can only buy two things. We buy these uh, things, which uh, are just uh, figurines we can buy, uh, which are free for some reason. Special settings is just, uh, you know, costume, but... And filter, but you have to unlock them. And then something else which we don't know yet. So, and the extra content is just, uh, obviously, Mercenaries versus which is like online multiplayer. And the two DLCs, which we have to uh, unlock in the remastered version. So, yeah, you get the DLC straight away. You don't have to buy them, unlike in the original versions, you do. So, so I'm going to start a new game. I'm going to do this on amateur mode because, obviously, it makes the game easier. Uh, but then you can make normal and veteran easier when you get something else in the game so uh, yeah that's very cool so uh, attack reaction will have that on uh, that that setting is just allows like if you want multiplayer anyone can join your game if it's no limits or invite only only invite players like let's say your friends and then rogue no one's allowed except me so um, off we go Resident Evil 5 then, I guess. You also get this history as well. This is the intro. This game is set in Africa, by the way. So, as you can see here, yeah. 
good, that's why it, the game is good. I should have seen it coming. It didn't take long after the fall of the Umbrella Corporation for their bioweapons to end up in the hands of terrorists. A new era of bioterrorism descended upon vulnerable countries, shifting the balance of power throughout the region. People in the destabilized areas soon feared another incident like Raccoon City was inevitable. As panic spread, governments of the world turned to the Global Pharmaceutical Consortium, which formed the Anti-Terrorism Unit, BSAA. Operatives of the BSAA were sent to infiltrate and neutralize bioterrorist hotspots, restoring safety and stability to various regions around the globe. Welcome to Africa. My name is Sheva Alamoth. Chris Redfield. Your reputation precedes you, Mr. Redfield. It's an honor. Just Chris, thanks. So you'll be accompanying me to the destination? Yes. Tensions are running high ever since the change in government. I'll bet. Intel says it's a haven for terrorists now. And I'm not going to be happy to see an American, BSAA or not. That's why I'm your partner. Help put them at ease. Well, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Partner. You okay? Yeah, sorry. It's nothing. Let's go. Casualties continue to mount over the long years I've struggled. More and more, I find myself wondering if it's all worth fighting for. Maybe one day, I'll find out. Hey, hey! You don't have to get touchy. Let's go. There is one thing I do know. I have a job to do, and I'm gonna see it through. Obviously, load times are going to be quicker because I'm, uh, I've replaced my Xbox One X hard drive with an SSD, two terabytes. Civilian checkpoints. So this is the first chapter of the game, first level basically. This is Kirk. Chris, Sheva, can you read me? Chris here, coming in loud and clear, Kirk. Yes, we read you. There's a black market weapons deal going down in Kijuju. That's where Irving will be. The Alpha team has already infiltrated the area, and you will be going in as backup. Rendezvous with your contact at the butcher's shop. You can gear up and get briefed on the mission there. Watch your backs. Roger that. Copy. Over now. Okay, so now we can go through here. We can see a lot of these people beating a bag up <laughs> for some reason. I don't know. Uh, kicking the shit out of it, so... so let's go this way. To the corner primary butchery. Surrounded by nothing at all, so let's just go on this way. Uh, see a better frame rate, obviously. And then we're gonna meet this guy. Dude, you're both here. Come. You too. This way. Maybe because of the new government, the people around here are a little on edge. You should do what you came here to do and go home. Yeah, they really roll out the red carpet for us Americans. I have your weapons for you here. 
So then what we do, we open the box to then get our guns and I think we get something else in there as well. Come on, I can't right now. And there was something else in there that we couldn't get, but uh, Destination coordinates. Found squares up ahead. Go through there. Alpha team's waiting at the deal location. Good. What do you know about Uroboros? Mostly just rumors. Something about visions of a doomsday project. Doomsday sounds about right, and apparently it is no rumor. You're kidding, right? You must find a man named Irving. He is our only lead. And be careful out there. And now, we get to control the game, and obviously, we also have a knife as well. Uh, and I just set the controls the same as Resi 4, so... Uh, is there anything else around here before we can leave? Uh, let's see, there's nothing there. Uh, what about past this butchered stuff? Nothing. We can't get out this door for some reason. Um, we can go this way. We're gonna go this way though. Remember, we're a team. Whatever happens, we stick together. Don't worry. I may not be as big as you, but I can still hold my hand. We get some cash there, and then down here, we got some crows looking at a dead dog or something. I don't know. Oh, there's someone there. I don't know. And with these crows, we can do. We can shoot them! Oh, but only the, only one got shot and the others flew away. But when you shoot the crows, you can sometimes get money out of them. Uh, so that's why I shot one. Uh, so we can be cruel. Okay, uh, is there anything this side? Nothing at all. Don't know who that guy was that we just saw briefly. But let's go in here to find some more stuff. We've got an herb, which looks like this, um, but yes, you still heal, uh, uh, you, you can still heal yourself with it, um, and with a massive herb here, we can combine it as well, to make a bigger one. Uh, is there anything else in this room? I forgot, um, no, okay, let's go kick the fucking door, and then, uh, oh, is there something this way? No. It came from that building. Well, let's go to the building then. And then we go through here. inside his mouth. Are you okay? Now he turns into a zombie! And instead of kicking, we punch them. And we can stop on them as well. <laughs> Do that. What the hell just happened? They didn't move like any zombies I've ever seen. Yep. So they're kind of similar to the Ganados in Resident Evil 4, but these are I think uh, I forgot. I forgot what they're, what they're called now. Oh yeah, Maginis, I think they're called. Um uh, so they're basically the African versions of um, of uh, the Ganados uh, from Resi 4, but only it's Resi 5, so... 
And then we have more of these coming, but instead of fighting them, we're just gonna run away. Which we are gonna do. And then Sheva will shut the bloody door, and then. Command Kerr. The locals were hostile, and we had to use force. We don't have any contingency plans for this situation, do we, Kirk? Roger on the locals, but your orders still stand. What does that mean? Was HQ expecting this? Let's get two people could kick this door. So yes, me and Chris and Sheva need to kick the door. Uh, so yeah, and then we're gonna oh some more ammo here, lovely. And then we're gonna go get rid of these barrels, and then now if you get a headshot on any of these Maginis, then you get lucky because then you can mostly just <clears throat> conserve your ammo and just use melee attacks, like punch them in the face and such. So yeah. So then let's go up the ladder and <clears throat> see what's up ahead. Another herb that we're going to combine. Boom, there you go. We can also move items, and you can also give items to Sheva as well, or bring them back. So, uh, useful if Sheva needs ammo, or, or something like that, but still, uh, and also if you want that item but you don't have enough room, then again, you can also make Sheva pick up items instead of you doing it. So yes, you can make her your slave. <laughs> okay, sorry, I had to... But, uh, yeah, uh, you can do that, and... Oh, there's another herb. Oh, and some ammo! Yes! And now, let's go in here to watch a really disturbing cutscene. And now, welcome to the hardest part of chapter 1-1. One -one. So, we're going to push this. So, to prevent these people from coming in most of the time. Uh, so, we need to push this. We, I could have also made Shadow do it, but whatever. But I'm going to get these. See if we can get oh, some more ammo. Yes. And then I need to go here. Destroy these berries to then get uh, something. Oh, we got a grenade. They're obviously going to get in eventually, but I mean, but at least we can uh, mitigate it. So, oh, there's a TV, there's a CRT TV here. But if we do this, we can break it. <laughs> Nothing happens. Um, uh, sorry, Shevin, you have none. So, because uh, I want to save some ammo for myself. Um, right. Oh, you can open this to get some more ammo as well. Um, you know, I'll give some ammo to Shadow then. Okay. No, no, not give. Okay. You can also use the D-pad to change ammunition as well, so that's cool. Okay. Uh, I am stuck. Uh, okay. So I'll try not to... Uh... And then punch him! There we go. And then we got to... Oh, oh, poor Sheva. All right. Sometimes you can punch more than one. Yeah, we got him a bit as well. Um, so it's best if you shoot them in the head, so then you can easily punch them in the face. Come in. The locals are hostile. The gate is sealed, and we're trapped. 
We need backup, and we need it right now. Roger that. Just stay tight. I'm on my way. You hear that, Sheva? Help's on the way. Got it. I'm also gonna try and use the knife because you can get an achievement for it. Uh, oh! Huh! Yes! I'm gonna try and use the knife. Oh, he fell! He fell as well. Then eventually we'll have a massive dude. Him! He will break that open. Now we can go through and do stuff. So, what we're gonna do first, we can get our very first achievement by burning enemies! At least three, to be exact. I don't know if I'll get it though. Oh, we have this guy. Oh, sorry. We don't have any. Oh, God. Oh, yes, we got an achievement. Uh, it's the stop, stop, drop, and roll. So, yes, defeat free Magini at once by setting oil canister on fire. So, yes, you get an achievement by setting them on fire. So, yes, that is really awesome. Uh, and now here, we got a machine gun. That's our first other gun we can get. Um, there's another oil canister there, in case you missed and you want to get the achievement again. Uh, but obviously, you won't get more than one achievement of the same, but okay. Um, oh, God. Uh, to defeat him, he's going to be difficult. Oh, whoa, I think he can throw things as well. Oh, wow, we punched that as well. <laughs> nice. Um, I'm going to try and use my knife a bit, because then... I guess he can kill some enemies as well. Um, oh, that was close. All right. We can also use those. I, I think I'm going to wait for him to get to those. There's just no end to them. True. We gotta hold out till Kurt gets here. Whoa, whoa, he can climb up there. Okay. Well, let's follow him. And then follow him again. Oh, he fell. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's here. Oh, what? And if you start dying, you want your partner to come to you. So then, you'll be safe. And if you run out, then you'll be screwed. So I'm just gonna... If you're near your partner, you can heal both... You can heal you, you and... You can heal yourself and your partner at the same time, uh, which is very useful. I recommend you do that. I'm just going to get this, and then I'm going to get this. Some grenades. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to use some grenades. Why not? Let's see if we can use some grenades. Boom! Well, I didn't mean to give the grenades. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm gonna try. Oh god! Whoa! What what achievement did I get? Meat shower. With oh wow! We got another achievement. Oh my god! Well, I'm gonna try this. Ah, I can't punch him. I'm trying to punch him. So then, if you defeat that massive guy, you will get something special from him. That's why you want to kill these enemies. Some of those. Right, full HP. Uh, give, me give me the grenades. All right, whoa, easy. All right, we punch him. Oh, I'm trying to punch him the third time because if you do that, you can get another treatment. Try this again. And I can't get it again. Oh my god. Whoa! What is that flying? Oh my god. Um. Alright. One, two, three. Through that. Boom! Alright. I'm gonna try and get him again. Come on, Shanna. Get him! Couldn't get him. Oh, what? Yep. If you die here, you'll get an interesting cutscene.
So in this case, it says your partner died. But if we restart it all, unfortunately, we have to go all again. But luckily, we go here and all that. So we have inventory and we have treasures as well. We've got none yet. But I doubt we will get some later. <laughs> Alright, so now we can also buy items as well with money. So, but we don't have enough for any of these. It's mostly just guns though. Um, but most of the guns you can get without buying, so you can pretty much get them for free. But others require you to um, get them through the shop, so they're pretty much, uh, most of it is not free. Uh, so, uh, we're gonna, so yeah, you have to do this all again. Uh, uh, so that's why this part is frustrating. Uh, at least we got those achievements, so I don't need to do them again. So it is recommended to still burn some enemies. Uh, okay. Oh wow, don't shoot me. Oh my god. I can easily shoot these. First person RE5! Oh my god. Shot him. Well, I can try and use my knife as well. Uh, while they come here. So when they, when they appear here. I can use my knife. Oh, actually I'll just... Because you get an achievement for using your knife. I think it's 10 enemies. I'm not quite sure though, but... Oh no! Yes, your partner can save you by doing that as well. Okay. But yeah. Ah, I got you! Hello, hello. Oh, got an achievement. A cut above. Yeah, so that's the achievement with the knife. Oh, nice. Oh no! Oh, God. Going to punch him! Oh, whoa! Oh, he opened it straight away! Oh my god! It only takes him a while to get here. Well, he only kicked one part of it. Oh, wait, no, the other part's gone. Never mind. I'm gonna wait for him. Oh, yeah. I'm going to burn him! Oh, with these genies. Oh, god, no! Jesus Christ. Um. Okay, um. I've got a grenade, so we're gonna try this. Then, punch him! Oh, you're not gonna get him at all, Shadow. Seriously. Alright, and then I'm gonna get this ammo, and then some herb, and another ammo, uh, something from the barrel, which is nothing, uh, oh, some, some money, and then, is it here? Okay. Whoa, okay. Right, we are surrounded. Oh, we just gave him a headshot. Oh god, he's here. Run away, run away, run away, run away. Run away from them. Can we get the machine gun again? Yeah, we can. Oh, but, but then again, it's, we, didn't, we didn't have the machine gun saved, so that's why. Uh, I've got the machine gun, but... Right, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna burn them all! Okay. Except he didn't die, so... I guess there's only another way we can get him. I'm gonna get his money, there we go. And I'm gonna get that, and then, um... I'm gonna get... Okay, we get, we've got to get that, and then... Uh, I'm gonna try and get him to one of those barrels, so then... It will bring massive damage. Where is he? Alright, he's following us here. Unless we have another grenade. No, we don't. Alright. Ah, oh, look at it. Right. We need to stand back. No! Oh, God damn it. Oh, no! We died! No! No! Seriously? I told you this is the hardest part of the game. Now it says you are dead. Just like traditional Resident Evil fashion. Yes, you have to do all of this again! Okay. So we'll get her to push that, and then I'm gonna push this. In fact, I'll, I'll get her to push it. So then I can focus on these. Yeah, this is pretty much the only hardest part of the game. And it takes a long time as well. In fact, the first thing's first with that guy, we'll just bring him to that barrel, so then... It doesn't really matter too much. Um... Yeah, you can't break it, you can't break it! <laughs> Alright. Got one grenade. I need to say that. And obviously we got the issue with the knife, so... I'm just gonna stay in here. So then they, they can come in here, and then... Oh, wow, he went out of the room! He went out of the house, oh my god! And what about you guys? Oh, uh, and then you got shot, uh... Whoa! That was a good dodge! Uh, one, two, three... Oh, you shot him. Shot him, I mean. Uh, so 
sorry, Shelly, you don't have any, so... Oh, well, I was expecting him to get stunned. And punch his back! There we go. Alright, and then... Let me do me. Ooh, headshot! <laughs> you can't get up there! <laughs> Again. Woohoo! Okay, I got you there. I'm gonna wait for him. Oh, wow, a lot of these with the same faces. Oh my god. Okay, he's here. Right, this way. Come this way. Stand back, Shadow. I'm gonna wait for him. Wait for him to come here. Okay. One, two, three, shoot! There! Massive stunned! Oh no. Are you kidding me? Again? God, how easy is it to die here? Yeah, this is probably going to take a while. Because this is how difficult this mission is. Even on amateur mode, it's very hard. Okay. Alright, so let's get these. Okay, we get a hand grenade. Oh, we have to do this multiple times. Multiple fucking times. There we go. Uh, break the fucking TV. And apparently, uh, hit Shiver as well. Even though you can hurt her with a knife like this, and blood comes out, it doesn't give her damage. Uh, I don't know why they made it like this, but... Uh, the same with shooting her. So if you have power more powerful weapons, it will actually damage. Look, so, yeah. You're still gonna be careful uh, to what you use, uh, but still. Right, I'm gonna use the knife. No, get off me! And then, um... Stop on your belly button, there we go, and then grab the grenade. You kick his nuts, and then I'm gonna... Oh, you get out of the house! Get out of my house! Alright, jump over, grab the coins, oh, there's more coins, more gold, and then uh, more uh, hand grenade. moves we're doing there. Alright, one, two, three, oh, no, get off me! God! Right, you break that, then I'm gonna go this way. Shiver, come here. Right, he's gonna follow us. This way. I'm gonna shoot that. Boom! I'm just gonna, but I'm not gonna bother trying to hit him in the third time. Right there. Or maybe it only works on certain enemies, I don't know. Because you can actually, after Shiver kicks the enemy, you can actually make Chris do it again. Um, I think it only works on certain enemies though, I, I think he's not one of them, so, um, so that's what I was trying to do, because you can get an achievement for it. Oh, sorry, you don't have any. <laughs> oh, God. Where is he? Oh, he's coming here. One, two, three, shoot! Burn them all! Oh, crap. I've got two grenades here. I'm going to use the grenade. And punch his butter! Oh, what? Come on! I'm going to use this grenade again. Okay. Okay, apparently Shepard kicked in again, but... Okay. Uh, is there anything in here? I've not checked in this room. Oh, there's some machine gun ammo. Oh god, no. Punch him. And then... Jump over. And then... Oh! Yes, I need the machine gun, obviously. Um, there's nothing. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna equip this grenade, so then... Yeah, he's here, right now. Apparently he's not getting burned. Only the others are. Um, okay. Um, oh god, no. Um, this is the most difficult part of the game. Because you have to wait. Did I shoot that? I forgot if I did. Um, no, I didn't shoot it, okay. Um, I'll just burn these because I doubt he's not going to get burned. Um, Time. Oh wow, I was shot in the head. Um, uh, and he exploded. Oh my god. I'm gonna keep the door open and then. Oh yes, what's in here? Some machine gun ammo. Oh god, is he here? Oh my god, he is. Oh no. I might have to start using the machine gun or something. Oh, I've got, I've got, I've got a grenade. Okay, nice. Oh my 
hard. This is so hard. I'm getting butchered at death. Are you serious? Oh my god, are you serious? We're gonna do all of this again. We were that close as well. I can't believe they made it this difficult, even on amateur mode. God. Oh god. Alright, there we go. Alright. I'm gonna get shut of this ammo. Well, I'll give it that as well. There. Then. Apparently we can destroy that as well. You get out of my house! They're trying to shoot through me. Oh my god. Okay. Then shoot him! And he's down. No! Got hit! Alright, so we go. Okay, fine enough. Skip the cutscene, skip the goddamn cutscene, and then... Oh, no! Okay. Alright, destroy this for me. Good boy! Alright. Get shot through here, then burn him! Let's just be shooting for a bit. I'll just shoot him for a bit, why not? Oh, did, did he get burned again? Oh my god! He got burned again! Now we're gonna make him follow us. This way. This barrel. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, he's here. Okay, we cannot do a third melee attack on him. Uh, okay. No! Oh! Jesus Christ! He keep torturing me! Oh my god! Alright. Alright, grenade. You're my only wish. Throw! Okay. Oh wow, the electric! Forgot about that. Did I shock him? I don't know. I don't know if I did. Right, let's just burn these. We gotta hold out till gets here. I think he got burned for a bit. Okay, there we go. Alright, here we go. Alright, ah, punch him! Alright. I'm gonna get past him, and then... I don't know if we can shoot that again. Uh, I think you get an achievement for it as well, so... We'll wait. And... Shoot! Okay, we shocked him. I think we get an achievement for it, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure you do. Well, it might be at least three enemies. Or three on one, so I'm not sure. I've got, but... I'm not gonna machine gun yet, but... Okay. Whoa! That was close! Oh my god! That was close! Oh my god. Okay. I'm gonna use the machine gun. Oh, wow! Those berries disappeared! Oh my god. Where is that massive dude? Oh, he's here! Oh, he's down! We killed him! Yes! And I've got an achievement. Ride the lightning! The female genie using electric uh, current from a transformer. Yes! Nice! And, and it just so happens to be that guy. Nice. Oh, what? Seriously? Let's reload. Now we just need to be careful. There's a barrel up there. I'm going to try and get him up there. Oh, there's, some, oh, there's a herb here that I need. Desperately need. Um... So we don't have to have that guy taunting us anymore. Thank God. Um... Oh, nice! Oh, wow, we destroyed that as well. Chris Redfield is apparently that strong. Um, I want you to get that shit. Come on. Shoot his face. Punch him in the face. There we go. And then get some money. Money, money, money. Finally, we've done it. When you see that message, that means you've finally done it. Kirk is finally here.
then, that is it for chapter one. That's one. It took us about 31 minutes. And yes, you get an achievement for it. For some reason, it appears slightly later on Xbox One, but it appears straight away on 360. So, I'd say we continue on, because I'd say we'll do a couple of chapters here in this video. So when we press OK, we go to this menu, and now we have treasures. Uh, this is the treasure we get uh, from that guy, the gold ring. Uh, this is what we get. Uh, so we can sell it for money. Uh, now, I don't think I'm going to use the machine gun too much, so I'm going to give that to Sheva. So she can have that, and you can also sell guns, so I'm going to sell this, when we sell this, we get some ammunition from there, so I'm going to give that to Sheva, and then, in fact, no, I don't need that, so I'm going to have that to myself, and then give her the machine gun ammo, I might need the grenade, so, and she's going to have that, uh, you have first aid spray as well, we have this gun as well, which we don't need, so, I'm going to sell that as well. Then I'm going to just... Uh, uh, give that to Chris, and then... Uh, we can also buy more guns, but I'm not going to yet, because obviously... Because with, with money, we can also do a glitch, which is why you need uh, an alternate account as well, so... But I'll show that off way later. Um, or I might do it myself, so... Uh, anyways, let's just go off the head then. Kirk, we owe you one. You can take me later. Chris, Sheva, it's almost time for Alpha Team to go in. Hurry to the deal coordinate. Roger that. Right. I'm going on ahead. We'll meet up there. Good luck. Okay, so now we can, um,. Uh, there's something here as well. Oh, I can't reach it from there. Well, I need to climb up again and then go on the other fucking side, but alright, um. I'm not gonna bother checking the other sides. Uh, so, yeah, that's finally chapter 1 1 done. It's probably the hardest part, almost. It's weird because it's the first one, you expect it to be easy. But no. Plus, even if you're more advanced than this game, it's still hard. So, yeah. It's even hard on the easiest difficulty, amateur mode. For some reason. Alright, let's go over here. And then... Yeah, the history of Resident Evil is just basically... Oh. So yeah, the history of Resident Evil parts is just basically telling you, telling you what happened in past games. I think it's mostly for Xbox players, because obviously uh, Resident Evil 5 is actually the first Resident Evil game to be released on an Xbox console. Uh, not counting HD versions of Resident Evil 4 or Code Veronica or, or the remakes of Resident Evil uh, 1, along with Resident Evil 0. Um, uh, but Resident Evil 5 is the first uh, normal game to actually come out on Xbox consoles. Or oh, others out, maybe two people can get around that. Then Sheva can get to Blair. There's a key. We can't get in from here. So, but there is another way to get in there. And it's something that I always forget. Oh, we've got a woman here. We're gonna shoot in the head and then punch. Yes. Yeah, we have this ladder here, and when I first played this, I never knew this ladder existed. Yes, I was a fucking idiot. So, that is how you get the key that we saw. And so, Sheva does that by herself, like a really good woman. And then, um, uh, first I'm going to get 
Yeah, the old building keys. But I know what exactly what it's for. It's something in this mission. I'm gonna get this grenade first, obviously. Whoa, hello, dude. Uh, I'm gonna put you down to sleep. There we go. And then um, I'm gonna get out of this door. Um, uh, you can activate the map, by the way, by pressing a button. I think it's different depending on the controls. Whoa, what achievement did we get? Get physical. To meet 20 enemies with physical attacks. Wow. I didn't expect to get that. Oh, my God. Um, okay. Um, oh, hello there. You're going down. Boy. Lovely. Got the machine gun ammo. And then we're going to go here with some tomatoes or tomatoes, depending on what you want to say. And then um, up here. I don't think we can get up here. It's locked from the inside, so no. No way you can get in there anyway. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, god damn it. Right, I'm going to shoot one of them in the head. So then, and then try and get them all. Okay, there we go. If I shoot like one of them, I can, or at least because they all ran away. So okay. Oh, her. We need the partner to pick it up. So, all right. What's in this barrel? Uh, just some money. All right. Well, let's get this. You can also mash the B button multiple times to to make Chris repeat his words. But okay. A woman's been kidnapped, but before we save her, this is what we need the key for, to get in this building. And what do you get in here? A shotgun! Except, I don't want Sheva to get it, I want myself to get it. Oh, right, let's give those. I, owe you one. I want to have the shotgun. So yes, now we can blow enemies up, including you, Sheva, or... <laughs> yes, if you try to aim your guns at, at your partner, they'll run away from you. So, yes. Um, now, say your partner, because obviously, you can. Uh, later in the game, you can play a Sheva and then have Chris as your partner. Uh, and, and, uh, and, and DLCs have, like, different characters to play as. So, yeah. That's what I mean. So, uh, we can go up here, but uh, nothing too much up here. So yeah, I never knew how to get this shotgun until later, when I found out about that ladder. Because I never saw it the first time. Not joking at all. Yes, I was a complete idiot. So now, we're going to try and save that woman. The pretty woman. Hey, what's wrong? Be careful, they may still be here. Yep, the woman's got the disease, so we need to run away and do the unfortunate thing. Oh, wow! But then this thing comes out of her, so. Which is just, again, just like the Ganados in Resident Evil 4. Um, I'm just gonna shoot that, why not? Uh, in fact, it's best if we use the shotgun. Do that multiple times. Don't have more ammo. Oh, okay. Oh wow. Okay. All right, you keep shooting there, Sheva, while I try and get this ammo. Oh, I'm gonna try and use the grenade. Obviously, get out of the way, Sheva. Out of the way. Boom! Oh, wow, we killed her. Nice. And we get this treasure from her. So then I can get this. There we go. And reload my shotgun. And those enemies are back. But we can get out. Uh, we're going to go this way. 
Oh my god, you're fucking yeah. Alright. Now let's go through the door. And then. Oh god. Some hostel? Okay, just kidding. Because <laughs> it's just like a basement. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, and then we can go this way. Uh, and then uh, up here. And then um, get this. What's in here? Some gold coins. Oh boy. What's in? There's something else here. What the fuck's in there? Oh, just some more gold. Um, yeah, let's get the hell up here, shall we? Uh, and then let's. Uh, oh, some two barrels together. <laughs> okay, sorry, I have to say it like that. All right, and then some shotgun shells and machine gun ammo. Uh, I need to refill some of my shotgun. Uh, all right. Oh, we can jump here, because here, we find some GOLD! Yay! Different amounts of money. So, yeah. Kirk, do you copy? We got the data. That Alpha team is down. Ruben got away. Roger. Relay the data from the vehicle at the storage facility. Copy that. And now? Oh, well, we need to check the rest of this room. This, but we have to keep moving. So we're going to check the rest of the room. Oh, there's some more shotgun ammo. And then, uh, something else over here. Okay. All right, and then, going to kick the fucking door. And then, uh, go on this elevator. Come on, Roger. Come on, right. come on, come on. Shove up. Come on! Come on! Okay. <laughs> we can just make Chris repeat his words <laughs> by just mashing. Uh, uh, well, for me, it's the B button on my Xbox uh, controller, but it might be different for you. I don't know. Roger. Especially if you're on PlayStation, I think it's the circle button for Type A controls. But it might be a different button for different control types. I don't know. Um, and then here. We have some door here, but it's locked with the key, so we can't go through. So, where we need to go is, we need to go, after we get these, we need to go this way. Oh, wait, is there something else here? No. Okay. So we need to go this way. Um. And then down here, um. We have something hot 
in here. Oh no. Oh whoa, okay. Um and then go through here. Nothing interesting in here. Get a furnace key. And get these. Getting a lot of ammunition. Okay. Uh we don't have enough room, so oh, I'm gonna give that to you, Shever. Give. I'll give all the help healing items to you, why not? Uh, we're not going to do that yet. Um, so, uh, we're going to then try and go through the door. But can we go through the door? We're going to get the cutscene, of course! Something bad's going to happen. It's a weird kind of creature. Um, so, what we do to him, I'm going to try and put this gas on the floor. Come on, Roger. We need to get Sheva this side. Then, I'm going to wait for him. No! Let's wait, Sheva. Then, and he's got that inside him. I'm gonna shoot it and boom! That happens. But then it'll stay stunned for a bit before coming back up. So, right, he's gonna come this way, obviously. But, when he goes inside this, or, oh, you can teleport as well. That's another bad thing. Okay. And then, I'm gonna shoot that. And then he gets on the floor. And then, I'm gonna wait for him to revive. Oh no! Then I need to. While he's in there, I'm gonna make sure he doesn't get out. Make sure he doesn't come out. There we go, he's stuck in there. This is what you wanna do to him. <laughs> we got you! <laughs> Burned him. And yes, if you or your partner goes in there, they will also die, so... That's the only way you're gonna kill him, unfortunately. Like, you can get a weapon later that you can just instantly kill him by just shooting him. So yeah, you can get a weapon later to just shoot him once and then kill him, but... That is way later in the game and it's like a cheat, so... Yeah. So, yeah, that is literally what you have to do to him. Uh, but also, there's something here that I completely forgot about nearly. Um, well, not just these, obviously. Um, but, across here, all the way here, you'll find a serpent medal. You, uh, there are, there's quite a few of these in the game. Some chapters uh, don't have any. Uh, a lot of chapters do, so... This chapter, I don't know if it's, that's the only one or if there's a couple of more. I think there's a couple of more that I missed. I'll come back for them, though. 
Uh, but yeah, uh, you want to get them for special things. Uh, so yeah, but also to get 100% achievements. Now we're in here. that scumbag Irving left behind to set us up. Considering what it did to Alpha Team, I think we're lucky to still be breathing. Only we could have gotten there sooner. If we had, we'd probably be dead too. Chris to HQ, do you copy? This is HQ. Excellent work out there. We'll analyze the data immediately. This whole town's gone to hell. The people here, they're acting like those Ganado detailed in the Kennedy report. And aside from that, there's something new, something we've never encountered before. Our transportation has been taken out, too. Requesting a mission update. The mission stands. Capturing Irving is your top priority. We believe we may have fled to the mines on the other side of the train station. Wait, we're the only two left. You want us to go in there alone? Delta team have been dispatched and are on their way. They'll assist you in locating and apprehending Irving. But wait, we can't! I repeat, your mission stands. We can't afford to let him get away. Proceed to the mines beyond the station. Over and out. This is insane! You ever get the feeling you're expendable? And that's the end of the chapter! End of chapter one. So yeah, oh we got an S rank! Yeah. You can view the BSAA file in the library, and yes, we completed 1-2. It's only 50 game of score for each of those, but yeah. But this time I'm going to press end game, um, so then uh, I can check out... Because when you go in chapter selects, you can see how many serpent medals there are. There's three of them. So we've only got one, which is the last one. Um, you can also go back to... Hopefully, not only to play them on different difficulties, but also to beat them faster, etc. So, I'm going to try and get those Serpent Medals, and I'll be back. Okay, guys, so the very first Serpent Medal you'll find is around this area in 1-2. So, so, remember that door we can't go through? There's a door underneath that we can go through. So, there we go here, and then um, we get, we're not only find some more ammo... Uh, is there anything here? You can move the box, but nothing else happens. Um, anything else around here? No. Um, unless there is. There's a door. A couple of money. Uh, it's empty. Oh, we can unlock this door. Wow. Um, obviously, we don't need to. Um, uh, we can go up here. Uh, destroy the CV, okay, um, but on this balcony, oh, oh we're gonna find some more of these first. Oh, come on! Are you serious? Wow, shot him. And right over here, right around here, we should find it. Um, I don't know where exactly, um, it is, um, Oh, there's something here as well. Oh, another treasure. Thank God we got it up here as well. Okay. Uh, now, the medal is somewhere around here, but I, don't, I forgot where exactly. Um, it's somewhere around here, I think. Um, well, it might be around here. Um, it's not up there. It's, uh... It's, uh... I don't know exactly. Um, it is definitely somewhere around here. Um, where is it? I don't know. I don't know where it is. Uh, hold on. 
Hold on, let me check the video again. Okay, apparently it's down, but I, I, oh, no, no. I think it's I think it's another part. I think it's another side, another balcony, uh, a different one. It's this balcony. Okay, it's this one. All right. There it is. There's the medal. It's right there. So that's that medal. So then the second one is before we find that dying person. So. Uh, is there anything else here? No. Uh, so, we'll quickly go there. Uh, okay. Um. Okay. Come on, Shadow. Alright, so now we're in this part. So, after we go up the first ladder... Well, first I want to get this again. Um. Uh, so when we go here... Uh, immediately, I'm gonna face up around here. There it is. It's right up there. Oh, there's a crow up there that I want to shoot. Oh, lots of crows. Oh, shot one. <laughs> and I get no, no reward for it. God damn it! All right, now we're back on the main menu. So uh, I'm gonna. See, let's. Uh, so we get this treasure from that woman, of course. And we get this one from that. Uh, the anti clock from that uh, other thing we just got. Uh, so. Um, so now. Um, uh, I don't know if there's anything we can buy. It's mostly just the guns we've already got. Yeah, it is mostly the guns. Uh, we can also buy a melee vest, which I'm not going to do. But uh, on the highest difficulties, this is. It's really recommended to use the these for both of your characters, so make sure you buy two of those. Along with something else that comes out later. Um, I don't think there's anything else to sell. No, there isn't. Okay. Um, in that case, we'll just... Um, I guess I'll put these that side, and then... It's down there. So. Well, that's about it for that. Uh, we got some... When you complete a chapter, you get points as well, so we can pretty much buy things with points. Uh, but it's, these are just figurines we can get, so... But also, versus mode, we can buy these as well, so that's kind of cool. Uh, we'll be getting the next chapter in a moment, but first... Uh, because the continue would only continue us from here, we're going to go to 2-1 two, da two from here. The storage facility. And you have to choose your difficulty. I'm going to do amateur again. Same settings as before. Off we go. Here we go. Again, with this chapter. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, we've got a gun here. What have we got? We've got a... An MP... We've got a mach another type of machine gun. Wow. Um, which I'll give that to Sheva as well. Um... So she can use that as well. Thanks, partner. Um, and then... Uh, so, there is a serpent medal in this room. Uh, we can also go here. That's just the tutorial. So if you hold the partner button, you can then... Go. Okay. Then press up or down on the D-pad. Okay. To then d uh, make her do other things. So, yeah, that's cool. We have something called serpent medals. Oh, uh, there it is. There's the serpent medal up there. Um, uh, that one's likely the first one you'll get because the others, uh, the first three are quite hidden in 1-2 so, uh, but that's likely the first one you might see so, if it's your first time playing this uh, or if you have played a bit before but not too much uh, and you're not looked at tutorials before this, but still uh, is there a, there is the ladder enable the map, because obviously I need it. Um, so treasure here. What's in that treasure box? Some money! Obviously. We need more money. We want Chris Redfield to be rich as hell. Especially with his massive muscles. Um, but yeah, this is a tutorial on what you can do. And, uh, I know. And now, let's go through here. Gets a bit harder, but still, it's not too hard. Now we're on the ocean side. Um, 
And then here, you want to shoot this like that. When music plays, it means there are enemies up ahead. Oh, whoa. Come on, punch him. Or not. That didn't work. I can go here for an herb. Except I can't get it. Uh, or can I? If Sheva will come here... I need to give this to you for a start. And pick this up. Alright. Oh, lovely. And I shot him to death. Oh my god. Now I'm going to go up here. I don't think there's anything up here we can do. Um, it's these two barrels with these things. Oh, machine gun ammo as well. Um, shoot that. I guess it's recommended to shoot that when enemies are near so then they can die as well. But eh, uh, we don't have any near us. Um, we need to go this way. Boom! Uh, is there anything this way? No. Oh, yeah, there is. I uh, forgot about this. Um, oh, it's a first aid spray. Come, okay. Come here, Shava. Okay. Okay. Could pick that up. There we go. Uh, I'm just going to use this. So we can heal both of us and then... Then... We have... Dogs. Menacing dogs. We need to shoot. And yes, these dogs can hurt you, yet one of them's on me. Oh my god. Yeah, and they're kind of difficult to kill with these guns, but... Oh no! It didn't even look like you were kicking him. Or her, Shabba. Come on. Alright, let's blow this thing up. I should have shot that to then kill the dogs. Oh no. Uh... Alright. Re oh, lovely. Punch down there. Oh, lovely. And then we're gonna get down here. Uh, and then get more hard stuff. And we have this fat dude. And then. Um, Alright, so now I'm going to bring a light to fire to burn them all. I think he's one of the guys where you can actually do that uh, achievement. Shoot his thingies, then we can do that. Oh, oh wait, he died already? Oh, no he didn't. Okay. Wait, what achievement did we get? Fireworks! <laughs> Shoot an enemy, Molotov cocktail. Oh, that, okay, yeah. Okay. I forgot about that achievement. We're getting a lot of achievements in this video. Um, oh my god. Um, Alright. Um, I don't know if we can get that achievement straight away, but... No, we've already killed him. It don't matter. We'll have to get it with, with uh, another one of those enemies. Uh, Oh, I shot. He shot me. And then I'm going to put him off. Then, oh, there's a doggy. Oh, no. Then we can do that. Oh, God, there's dogs around us. And then they attack us for a bit there. Yeah. Die, doggies! <laughs> when the music stops, that means everyone's gone. Anything else around here? No. And then we get another hard part of the game after this part. After this. Oh, we get a red herb for a start. You grab it. Uh, which we'll need to combine later. Uh, some more ammo there. Uh, but we're going to get one of the hardest parts of the game, sort of, uh, with these type of guns at least. Um, so, I'm going to, uh, in fact, no, I cannot actually, um, I need to give, uh, Sheva a couple of these, um, I'll give Sheva this, 
And I'm going to request that and use that for this part. Because trust me, this part is very difficult. This truck is going to try and run us over. Shoot it. But we're too late. And this happens. Yep, it's very hard to aim at it. Because you have to shoot the driver. Not joking. That's why I recommend guns that... Um, I could easily... Uh, uh, insta shot. So we got a uh, jaw bangle. We can sell that. Uh, I'm going to just give Sheva that. Temporarily have that. Um, but I will give back this. Uh, I will give that back. Um, I just need it for that part. Luckily, it saves to that part. So. Come on. Okay. Um, Alright, and then we're going to go here. Doo -doo. supposed to shoot them. I thought you always had to shoot the window. Because that's what I was used to doing. But no. Okay. Okay, there's another achievement you can get uh, when these sh get shot. It's so that you can deflect these. Okay, I'm going to try get it. Wait, what? Baptism by fire. Oh, wow. 
Okay. Beat three Virginias at once, okay. If you could stop shooting through me, Shadow, oh my god. Okay. Because there's an achievement you can get by deflecting items with your knife. Uh, and you get a lot of gamer score, and you even get a silver trophy on PlayStation. Um, so, yeah. Um, for deflecting items uh, with your knife, it's very hard. Luckily, you only need to do it once, though, to get the achievement, so... Might have to try that in later... Uh, missions. Okay, um... Uh, what's over here? This. Some gold. Lovely gold. And then... Okay. Then here we have dogs, but we can just run past them. You don't even need to fight them. They won't even attack us when you run through them. So I've been, I've been doing that a lot, and... Yeah. Okay, let's go here. Oh, oh, there's something else. Except I can't get it, so... Oh, what? The dogs do, do follow you. I can't get past. There's a lot of them. You dog. And now. Take it. And I get you to get that. And then. Oh, I can pick that up as well. Okay. And then. Shove up. Hurry. And then. We have some items here. Oh, but first. We have these things, which I'm going to use my shotgun for. I don't know what these are, but... Okay. We got them. Okay. Wow! Okay. And then we can get that. We can shoot this lock. Like that. Okay, thank god I've reloaded. I think there was an item here as well. It's all the way back here. Um, it's like a treasure we can get. Yeah, the Sapphire Pearl. There's quite a lot of the different coloured uh, gems you can get for treasure. Uh, there's also a ruby, an emerald, uh, and a couple of others as well. Oh, it's a rat! Kill the rat! Kill this rat. There's another rat here. Let's kill all the rats. We get some coins from rats! Oh my god! Okay. Um. Oh, there's a herb here that I need. Oh, but I can't get it, so Sheva needs to get it. Okay, nothing there. Thought someone came out of there then. In the water, you can also find another treasure. We go around here. And I just realised I've forgotten one of the serpent medals. Alright, we got that. I forgot what that was. I think it was a pearl one. I'm not sure. I've forgotten one of the serpent medals. Uh, it was under the bridge. Uh, I'm going to see if I can go back. I'm not sure if I can, though. Uh, quickly, uh, so I'll be right there. It's, it'll be interesting going back. Um, let's hope those dogs don't come back. Because I believe out here we can find a serpent medal I completely forgot about. Oh, wait, no, it's not there, it's further on. Um, okay. 
Wait, what? We can't get out now. Oh, no, we have to... Well, we'll come back later then. Because I knew there was a serpent metal under a bridge. Under the bridge. You know, the bridge where that truck tried to ram us over. Uh, there was actually a serpent metal under the bridge. I uh, uh, completely forgot about it. But luckily, I know where some of the other serpent medals are. I know where one of them is. It is well hidden, but... Trust me, I know where it is. Uh, so... It's not around here, but... I'm gonna go up here. Then in that green thing... We find that it's in there. It is up there. There it is. It's not likely you'll find it because it's that hidden, but... Okay. I'm gonna shoot that. Okay. And then... A uh, couple of other things around here before we can go ahead. So, before we can go ahead and make someone's day. Okay, uh, I had to say that. Uh, bring some more fucking berries. Uh, for more fucking ammo. Alright, um... Anything else? What's in here? The saloon. There's nothing in there. Um, is there anything behind this building? Uh, I don't, don't look like it. Aside from gasoline that you cannot pick up and set enemies on fire with. Um, oh, we can go up here. I don't know if there's more serpent medals around here. I think there's one later on down this way. Uh, there might be one around there. I'm not sure. Exactly. Uh, I'll have to check later. Nice. Okay, guys, I'm back. My apologies there, so we are going to go through this door and uh, up here we'll find a key hanging on this dead body. Then we pick it up, the port key, and then we're going to get the cutscene. And there's a lot more machinis, so. But luckily. We just need to go through that door over there. Uh, it looks like there's a boat. We can get on the boat, but there is something behind there, but I'm not going to get it. It's, I don't think it's treasure. I think it's just like more am ammunition and such. So we're going to go this way. Oh, I got shot. Oh, I deflected it, I think. Before I got this cutscene. Oh my god. Wow. That is incredible. Oh, I wanted to punch him, but I didn't think HQ actually cared. Well they do. Uh, over here we find another serpent medal. Right over there. I need to shoot it. I missed. I need to shoot it. Good boy. Alright. Pick that up, Shever, for me. Good girl. And then I'm gonna go this way. Uh, the last serpent metal is like way ahead, so. Oh, uh. Come on. Come on. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna. Over here. Oh, I burned myself, god damn it. So I need to shovel the pistol. Oh, I didn't mean to give the grenade. What the hell? Right, so then we're going to kick that open, and then what's in here? A rifle that I can fortunately get. And then, uh, oh god, there's him again. Uh, then I go to, uh, I'm going to go this way. To this door. Come here, Shiva. Oh, I got shot. Come here, girl. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like that, but okay. And then, the hardest part of this chapter is here. I think we'll do this and then we'll finish the video off. Well, obviously I'll get the other super metal in this mission as well, but after then we'll finish the video off. Um, um, oh god, whoa. Uh, 
I think we'll get that herb uh, on the way back. Because up here, we're going to get something interesting. Yep, I think Kirk is down. He's dead. Okay, and then... Okay, um... Uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Uh, exchange that with this. Then I'm gonna... I'm gonna shoot, I'm gonna kill him first. And then, I'm just gonna use this to heal myself. Or heal partner as well, but okay. And then pick that up, I, I might as well use this as well. So then we both have full HP. Uh, I don't really need rifle, but whatever. Uh, whatever, uh, we'll just have to stick with it. We can bring Chevrolet up here. Come on, Come you grab it. Okay. Right, and then, okay. Shiver and Lamar can get up here. Some other ammo. While Chris, which is what we're playing as, can defeat these enemies. Along with these BOWs that are flying everywhere. And he got shot. <laughs> I'm just going to use... Uh, in fact, no, I'll use this. And I'm going to punch him in the face. There we go. Fuck yeah. And then we're gonna go. Oh, oh. Hey there. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, we can snap his neck. Oh my god. I forgot you could do that. Right. There's a shotgun. There we go. And then I'm gonna shoot his pee pee. There we go. And I'm gonna slash his back. Yeah, take that, naughty boy. Alright, and then... Oh, red herb. Uh, I don't know if I can pick that up, though. Um, I feel like I can't... <clears throat> Give all of that to Shadow. And I'll discard it. And then I'll pick this up, and then... Now, we cannot uh, go... To that door. Oh, god damn it. Um... We cannot get that door manually, so what we need to do is we need to go up here first, defeat him, who is annoying. Uh, got some other out of the way. Um, then we need to go up here. Uh, get these barrels for no goddamn reason. Uh, I did the one, only one destroyed and not the other for no goddamn reason. Uh, we need to get Sheva over here, but first, the other serpent medal is up here. Um, right there. Can easily grab it. Just like that. And then, while Sheva's down there, we are being attacked by someone with a spade. So, we need to kill him. Of course. Oh, there's two people. Oh, no. Uh, there's another man uh, that we need to kill. Okay. Oh, there's another. Oh, my God. We've got important items in front of... Right. You know what? I don't need them. We'll combine these. There we go. And we need to go down. Uh, Sheva's still fighting him. Oh, God. Uh, it's right there. Well, thank God she can heal herself. Uh, she is independent like that. Um, uh, we're going to... Uh, let's go down, shall we? Oh, uh, some machine gun ammo that we will give to Shadow. Or... I thought there was something else, but no. It's not from the other side. This is why we need Shadow with us. Okay. And we're going to shoot that so then these enemies are out of the way. Or at least some of them. Oh wow, headshot, nice. And then, 
when we go up here, we have our worst enemy. Uh, but first off, I need to... Oh, I can't give them to Shadow. Uh, okay, we'll get them later then. We get a checkpoint, luckily. Then... Our worst enemy. You see that? Yep. Chainsaw. Basically, Texas Chainsaw Massacre Plagiarism. Okay. Okay, I had to say that. Okay. But it's in Africa. And it's even a creepy version. It's this. It's not Dr. Salvador, though. Um, I forgot what the name is in Resident Evil 5, but I'm going to bring that down. I'm going to bring in closer. So then, I'm going to one, two, three, boom! So then, we just need to kill him. We just need to try and get him down. So, I'm going to wait for him. Boom! And then, oh, we got him. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, no! No! Despite cutting their head off, their head stays in place if you look carefully. Oh, hold on, guys. Okay, guys, I'm back with the chainsaw, so here we go. Yeah. Okay, first things first, we're gonna shoot that down! And then shock him. And then we're gonna get him again. This. There we go. I'm gonna see if I can uppercut him. And I cannot get him the third time. Okay. Well, let's get him over here then. Wait. Two. Oh, come on. Get over here. Wait, uh. There we go. Oh, no, he's not down. Okay. We're gonna have to try and get him again. Let's try and get him on this electric again, shall we? Alright, come here. Shock! And then... Alright, I can't get him again, but... Oh, come on! Are you serious? Get off me! Uh, he's following Shadow, okay. There's another barrel there, so... I'm gonna try and get him here. Get him as well. <gasps> okay. It's down like that. Can also shoot him in the head, but that's gonna take forever. Eat. I guess I could shoot him from here. mode, then he will come back to life, so you got to be careful. And then we're going to go this way, with the key, and then, uh, is there anything here? Fuck no, there isn't. Um, but over here, oh, not there, it's further on. I'll just change the pistol. Oh, sorry, Shepard, you can get that, okay. Alright, uh, you can get lots of gold in here. Lots of treasure. Alright, we've got all that. And then... Come here, Shabba. Then, that is it for the chapter. I think it is. That should be it. Well, a bit of walking, and then... Or oh, is there something in here? 
<laughs> Nothing. Okay. Uh, first, is there anything we can do? Uh, no. Uh, the grenades are pretty much fine, and then... Okay, let's go ahead and open this area then. And then, we're gonna get something, a return, from Resident Evil 4. But now it's in Resi 5, so here we go. Get quick time events where you need to press buttons at the right time. Yep, that makes a return in this game. At least they're easier than our equals. Team saved us all. Oh my god. Man, am I glad to see you guys. Delta Team Captain Stone, Chris Redfield. Shiva. Thanks, Josh. I owe you one. You guys know each other. I trained under Josh. He taught me everything I know. Shiva became little sister of the team. Now, Shiva, you must continue your search for Irving. According to the data we retrieved from the hard drive, we believe he has moved on to the mining area. There's more info inside. We'll follow after taking care of business here. And keep your radio handy just in case. Thanks, Josh. Okay guys, so the medal that we missed under the bridge, I think we go down here first, and then it is right over there. So luckily, you know, it's, so luckily it's after the truck, so, okay. Gonna, now let's just quit. Uh, so, I think that'll be it for today's video guys, so... I'd say next time on Resident Evil 5, we will go through uh, the rest of Chapter 2. And uh, hopefully, we can do more stuff there. So I should see you guys next time. It's IJ Poop out. See you guys next time. Bye!